A regular trip to McDonald's may consist of a Big Mac or shake, but things were a little different today in Bemidji. Haiti Clotter has more in this story. The newly renovated McDonald's on Paul Bunyan Drive welcomed the local Boys and Girls Club by donating 20% of today's sales to the club as part of its grand opening. Well, McDonald's has been involved with the Boys and Girls Club um, of the United States and across the country for many, many years. So it was a really easy transition for us to get involved with our local chapter here. We're dancing to celebrate the partnership between the newest locally owned McDonald's and the Boys and Girls Club of Bemidji. You ready, guys? Ready. They're very community minded and so we're thankful that they believe in our mission to serve youth in our community to have a fun and safe place after school and in the summer. The Boys and Girls Club of Bemidji is a youth serving organization that serves youth ages 6 to 18 years old. The club offers academic, health and leadership programs year round. I like going to the garden and picking all of their fruits and vegetables. It's fun. The art room because we I like painting and I also like the garden. Kids were on hand passing out items and receiving donations. Members of the community think what McDonald's is doing is a good thing. Great. It's so nice. That means so much. It just makes me feel like there's other people who like care about, you know, what we're doing and makes us feel, you know, like we matter around the community and stuff. This community, Bemidji is excellent. They support their nonprofits. It's just unbelievable. The Boys and Girls Club rewards all who are involved, from the kids to the staff. See them grow and become little just people and their personalities developing and it's really great to see. What I think about Boys and Girls Club, it's it's a place that feels like home to me. In Bemidji, Haiti Clotter, Lakeland News. The Boys and Girls Club has an after school and summer program for more than 600 youth right in Bemidji. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.